Good afternoon, everyone. Today I'm here to speak to you and inform you uh, why sleep is so important. Sleeping is just so vital to so many different parts of your body, and that's what our this, or my discussion is going to be about today. Are any of you, like myself, sleeping five hours or less and waking up not feeling energized by show of hands? I'll be the first to raise my hand to say that I am a little sleep deprived right now. Sleeping is very essential for the well-being and health of all people. I have a niece that normally gets around eight plus hours of sleep per day. But what I have observed is that she is always in such a great mood and she's very, very productive, always happy, uh, wanting to do different things. And it's because she's always so well rested because she gets her sleep. I used to tease her because she slept so much, but now I see and have and understand the importance of all of that sleep that she gets. Today, I'd like to talk about why sleep is important and how it helps your concentration, keeps you focused, and improves your overall daily uh, health and performance. I'm going to talk about three main points. First, I'll discuss how sleep helps the brain to function properly. Second, I will discuss the importance of sleep and your physical health. And third, I will discuss sleep and how it affects your mood and emotional well-being. The National Institute of Neurological Disorders and Stroke tells us that sleep is an important part of our daily routine and we all spend about a third of our time doing it. I don't know if any of you have ever put any thought into how much time you spend in sleeping, but as they say, it's a third of our time. Without sleep, we can't form or maintain the pathways in our brains that help us learn and create new memories. And it makes it harder to concentrate and to respond rapidly. Have you ever just been like really tired? Somebody ask you like a very simple question and you struggle to answer it, even though you know this is something that you know, but your brain is just not functioning. It's because of that lack of sleeping. So sleep is very important to several brain functions, which includes how nerve, cer now, excuse me, nerve cells communicate with each other. Your brain and body stay active even while you're sleeping. Recent studies suggest that sleep plays a housekeeping role while you're sleeping because during the hours that you're awake, there's toxins that are in your brain that need to be removed. And the only way those toxins can be removed is while you're sleeping. Another great reason why we should get the proper sleep. Now that I've discussed how sleep affects the brain, I will discuss the importance of sleep and your physical health. Everybody needs sleep because it affects almost every part of the body to include the heart, brain, lungs, and sleep increases your metabolism. Your mood and your overall well-being are determined by the amount of sleep that you get. Sleep is a process that affects how our bodies perform on a daily basis. It helps the healing and repair of our heart and blood vessels. It promotes healthy growth and development. And our immune system relies on sleep to keep us healthy and strong. I'm sure many of you have had times where you just couldn't understand why you felt sluggish, you thought you were sick, thought maybe you were catching the flu, when really it was just a lack of sleep. Being sleep deprived can cause many things. We don't know what they are, but it's just that you need to get the proper rest. So now that we've talked about the effects on the brain, we're going to talk about the effects on our moods. When you don't get a good night's sleep, 
you're easily irritated and grumpy. I know I am. I don't know about anyone else, but I can be very grumpy if I don't sleep. You're snapping at everything. There are studies that show the lack of sleep increases negative moods. The lack of sleep causes sadness, anger, frustration, irritability, all of those things. So again, there are those days when you are just everything seems that it irritates you. You're frustrated about everything. Normally, it's because you have not gotten enough sleep. Your body's telling you that you need more sleep. We have to listen to our bodies. When we don't get enough sleep, it's very difficult to get yourself in a positive space. No matter how hard you try, everything is just negative. You're not positive about anything. It doesn't matter what anyone says. You have something negative or you're just frustrated and irritated just because someone looks at you. Get some sleep. Long periods of being sleep deprived can lead to depression and anxiety. Lack of sleep can produce some harming effects to our overall emotional well-being. So, today I have discussed how the brain needs sleep to function properly. I discuss sleep and your physical health, so important. And finally, I discuss the effects a lack of sleep can have on your moods. All three very important things. So sleep is vital for the well-being and health of people. And I hope everyone leaves here today knowing that getting enough, enough sleep is very important. Thanks for taking the time to listen to me and get some sleep.